everybody. Um, good day to you. Um, this is Glen Trayer, Trayer Wilderness. I had something on my my mind. Um, I was thinking skeeters are getting crazy. Um, something on my mind for quite a while now. Um, and I'm, I'm, I've prayed about it, and I, I feel like God's telling me to, to um, make this video. Uh, I'm very, I'm very uh, cautious on this um, because I. I think there's good intentions. I think there's good um, I'm not saying that this is bad. Again, I'm, I'm, I'm as we're talking right now, I'm, I'm asking the Holy Spirit to guide me um, because I don't want to say the wrong thing. I don't want to um, be disrespectful to anyone. Um, and I, I by no means am being disrespectful to anybody. Um, I, I, I just I just feel like I said this is something that God has put in my heart to say. Um, I'm gonna try and keep this video fairly short. I don't know how short it's gonna be, but I, I, I'm I just think this is something that needs to be said. It's on the subject and I've seen this happening for a long time. Um and it seems to be getting more and more prevalent. Uh, YouTube videos and, and stuff. Okay. Um, again, I'm not quite sure how to how to say this without offending people, but I guess if the Holy Spirit's guiding me, um, He'll give me the right words. Anyway. It's on this idea of converting, converting to Hebrew. Um, and I might have just stopped some people and made them, pissed them off. Honestly, I, I'm, I'm not trying to, like I said, but I think it's something that needs to be addressed. Uh, because you read the Bible in some in, in Hebrew does not make you a better follower of Christ. Because you read the, the Bible is the Bible whether you read it in Hebrew whether you read it in um, Arabic, whether you read it in um, whatever, Deutsch, um, whatever, it, it, it doesn't. It, the the Bible, God's word is God's word. All right, cut. You gotta quit rubbing up against me. Um, God's word is God's word. Uh, I, I, and <clears throat> I've gathered up a couple verses. Um, again, I'm because we got some dear friends um, that speak in Hebrew, and and some of them I I, I don't know personally if they're Jews or not. Um, and, and I'm not speaking against that. What, what I am speaking against, is, and, and, and I'm not really speaking against it. I'm just saying that, you know, we, we need to be careful. We need to be careful because I got a couple verses that I wrote down. I felt God showed them to me. Um, and I, I'd like to read them to you. Um, you'll have to excuse me. I'm not the best, world's best reader, so... 
But uh, this is, and when I'm saying this, I, I encourage you to go to these verses and read before and after um, this verse. Re get more of a, an idea of what's being said here. Um, and don't and, and please don't just take my word for for this. Go go and look it up for yourself. Um, but the first one is in Romans three thirty. There is only one God, and He makes people right with Himself only by faith, whether they are Jew or Gentiles. Um, I I, I think that says says it all right there. Uh, but I, I'm going to carry on. Um, this is Galatians 4.10. You are trying to earn favor with God by observing certain days, months, seasons, or years. Just because we read God's word in a certain language does not make us right with God. Um, it is faith in Him, it's faith that Jesus Christ died for our sins and we are forgiven. Um, it, it's not by the law. The law was put in place, um, yes, um, but through Christ dying on the cross, He has done away with the law. Um, and that's scriptural. Um, it's not saying that the law is no more, but the law was was given in a, before Christ came. They needed sacrifices. They needed um, all this stuff. Certain things had to be done a certain way, you know. And, and it, Christ did away with that. So why are we trying? To observe certain things and, and there's I don't feel that it, it's wrong to observe these things but what is the motive behind it are you trying to draw closer to Christ through this or are you trying to earn favor by doing these things if you are trying to earn favor by doing these things you're doing the wrong things you're doing the wrong things because it's by faith that we are made right with God. Um, Galatians 2.6 Yet we know that a person is made right with God by faith in Christ Jesus, not by obeying the law. And Galatians 3.9 So all who put their faith in Christ share the same blessing Abraham received by his faith all the no you know the, the old testament and the uh, traditions and stuff um abraham was the father you know of 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 um i guess you say, of, of israel they everybody kind of refers back to Abraham and so on and I'm, I'm not I'm by no mean there's there's I'm not a scholar I'm not there's a lot I don't know about Jewish traditions and and and, and so on um and and I'm not against tra those traditions um if you do them please do not think I'm against them but I, I'm just trying to get people to think a little bit about why are they doing these things what what is the purpose behind it? Um, another one uh, is in Romans four uh, or fourteen twelve to thirteen. Yes, each of us will give a personal account to God. So let us stop on condemning each other. Decide instead to live in such ways that are that. Stinking Skeeter, in such ways that you will not cause another um, believer to stumble or fall. 
and then Romans 14 7 um, for the kingdom of God is not a matter of what we eat or drink but of but of living a life of goodness and peace joy in the Holy Spirit I want to go back to Romans um, 14, 12 to 13. Um, I think sometimes by, and I've watched some videos and stuff which I don't get to watch much YouTube and that, but um, some videos of, of people basically condemning Christianity which I, I'm that's a whole nother subject but um, saying that if you're if you don't follow Jewish traditions and stuff you're not going to see Christ I'm sorry but if you're saying that you're wrong because it is not the traditions that set us right with God it is our faith in Christ Jesus. And if you are doing that, you are causing other believers to stumble and fall. Um, again, I'm, 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 not, I'm not naming any names. I'm not saying anything. And, and, and if you, if you um, do these things and you follow these things, um, I urge you to think why am I doing this am I doing this to have a closer relationship with Christ or am I doing this to earn God's favor why why am I doing this if you are one of those people that are doing it and I'm not condemning you because I am not the judge he is I fall short all the time and that's the beautiful thing about Christ Christ's love and grace and mercy and forgiveness we do fall down we, we fall down but he lifts us back up he picks us back up and sets us back on our feet um, it's not the law the law does not make us right with him and whether you say study the, the the Bible in Hebrew or, or or whatever language you study it in it doesn't make you just because you read it in, in a certain language it doesn't make you um, a follower of Christ it doesn't make you a, a, a believer you know, you, you can, and, and it, the Bible's uh, it, it, all through the Old Testament and, and into the New Testament. It, it is full of things, of examples of how people did this. They're, they tried so hard in their actions and, and doing things and, and, and certain traditions and certain things. And that's not what God wanted. He wants a relationship with us. He wants us to have faith in Him and in what He says is true and know that it is true. Um, again, it, 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 it. So we have some followers that say things to us in, in Hebrew um, on, our, on our YouTube channel. And I, I am I'm not saying anything against you. Please, please don't take this that way. Don't take it that way. I'm I'm not I'm not condemning anyone for doing what they're doing. I'm just asking you to take a minute and think about why you're doing these things. You know, and, and if if you're you're a Jew, and it's part of your heritage, and and that's what you you do, uh, you know that I understand that. That's you know, 
That's, but there again, why are you doing that? Are you doing that to grow in a relationship with Christ? Or are you doing that just because that's heritage and that's that? Um, now, there's a lot to be learned by going back and studying Hebrew and, and, and things like that. Um, there, there's a lot, a lot to be learned. Um, but, again, please take time and consider why you're doing these things. Um, and you, if you go to some of these YouTube channels and they, um, man, these mosquitoes are getting crazy. Um, if they're saying, you know, that if you don't convert to Hebrew and if you don't, um, to Judaism and, and, and you don't, um, study the Bible in Hebrew and you don't speak with, in Hebrew and stuff, cat's going to knock the camera over. Get out of there, cat. Get, um, you know, they're, they're, they're saying if you don't read this stuff and, and, and that, you're, you're done. You're, you're not going to heaven and you're, you're, you're a Gentile and you're a sinner and we're all sinners. We all have fallen short of the glory of God. Um, so, again, just think about it. I'm not trying to offend anybody. Please don't take it that way. Just, just think about it, pray about it, and ask God to speak to you. That's, that's all I'm, that's all I'm asking. And, uh, may God bless you and, and, and keep you. And we'll see you, uh, I guess, in the next video. Take care, guys. God bless.